it's been all day. It, it started, it stopped at half one this morning, it started again at six, half six this morning, and it's been all day. So we're on route now, just waiting for Liam to turn up. We are somewhere at the services, uh, Newark way on. It's the, it's the Dirty Mackies one. And as you all know, I, uh, my body's a performance machine, so I won't be eating that shit. Um, basically, well, I buckled a little bit. There was this weird looking dude outside, and he's like, uh, I'll get a chocolate milkshake if I can touch your cock. I'm like, nah, mate, not having that. But anyway, we're just waiting for Liam to turn up now, and uh, we'll get on route. Cheeky bit, look. He pulls in, he don't even want to be seen with me. I guess I'm not in the cool kid club. Just the idea of doing that operation to someone who's leaving their building out of their house. Now there's people that have talked about what they've done with those ever watch any of those videos, those videos are horrific. Those were censored. Those were like censored. I hope you won't fill in my crocs. Hey. Are they in four-wheel drive? No, these are two-wheel drive. They definitely couldn't get away from once, them. Once we get to showgrounds, I'll slam them in four-wheel drive. <laughs> oh no no we're still going uphill and he's catching us up again that's what they like though Oh, you know, well, I went by you. Yeah, because I went to you were going downhill for the He's not playing. He's like, cue lot of truck fest. <laughs> I'm grafting. He might be going in parking trailer up somewhere. Oh, he's the spotter. Give him a tang hand. Give him a tang Give him a whistle at tang hand. Give him a tang hand. I dare you. <laughs> How much do you reckon them new Mustangs are, them E-Mac Mustang things? They've got to be some coin them and they're just sat there in long grass rotting. Yeah, yeah. And the Fords as well, so they brush these. So we're a couple of hours into driving up and down a car park. Uh, we've got uh, the truck and the van washed, and I think, I think, we're just about to get in. So at this point the marshals parking us up decided to take Liam down this slope which doesn't look bad on camera but it was enough to rip his 500 quid light bar off the bottom of his truck. Then I thought I was going to use my new rope and everything, but no. You know why that is, don't you? Follow me. We eat, mate. Don't get stuck. <laughs> Right, so most stuff's shut at the minute, but it's Friday night, so we're just gonna have a quick wander around. We're gonna see what's about, then we're gonna have a few beers and probably stay in too late in the morning. So, yeah, we'll see what the weather's gonna do, because if it rains, there's gonna be a lot of stuck people. I don't know, do you reckon everyone's in yet or? I reckon there'll be a few turn up tomorrow morning probably. <laughs> you love it down you? you're his biggest fan. I'll give him what he likes to tie it.
you make a zzz noise, you're a drone. <laughs> oh, shit. Do you know the best bit is? If you do this. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, okay, now. Do you know? Wow. Oh. Good morning. I have got to say, I have never known a show as noisy and loud as this. Half past one this morning, there were air horns going. Half past six this morning, there were air horns going. Half past seven, air horns revving stuff up. Wow. Yeah, normally, my uh, Saturday morning, Sunday morning when I'm at a show is me laying, because you don't get it normally. So, uh, yeah, I almost refuse to get up. Right, so it's time to start moving, it's about half past nine. We've had a bit of a lazy one. It's, um, like I say, it's it started from about half past six. So you keep getting woke up, drop off, woke up, drop off. It's all fun though, isn't it? Um, it's like kids at Christmas, isn't it? With noisy toys. So, what we're doing, um, I have plumbed the cooker up, but it involves going in the boot at the minute and turning the gas on, which ain't fancy. And so, Ridge Monkey to the rescue. <laughs> I also need to get a bigger cow. weekend out this isn't a bad one is it free beer free food free entry get a brown eyes with the gaffers <laughs> question is though are you gonna, are you gonna start polishing those and bringing shows no. <laughs> so we're on a long mission now so he's bent his light bar he's whacked it off the grass we've managed to pull it back into place so that's all right now but I feel like you saved some money so you need to buy some, I don't you? My way of thinking is I'm now the form you could to spend on some money. <laughs> and his missus in here, supervised. Anyway, so we're just going to get a bit of food now. Um, we cooked the breakfast at the van. We had a meal out um, while we're walking around. I'm trying to only have one meal out and about because it is 
expensive and not only is it expensive the portions are tiny everywhere so yeah uh we get back now we can have some pate french stick all that stuff a little bit of a picnic then get back out on it see a few more people hey liam i see your crocs <laughs> So I think everyone's on about six baby shams and they're all revving their uh, engines and blasting the horns, so... Some nice sounding trucks here. So there was a stern email about blowing your horn. Everybody uh, listen to that. <laughs> it's been all day. It, it started... It well, stopped at half one this morning. It started again at... Six, half six this morning, and it's been all day. Seven hours into non-stop horn blasting. Loving life. So that's another day at truck fest and uh, we're back in the sprinter as we're still fitting it out we've got the power bank we've got the o-light we've got the bed it is what it is shower pod obviously is not where it needs to be but it is a comfy as bed it's warm in here it's dry in here it's not a bad place to be is it so we're going to dive in this pit now we're going to try and get an early night because uh, of all the absolute weapons that get up early and start pressing horns because We've had a mooch, we've had a look around the vehicles, we've had a look in the stalls, but it's hard to vlog anything, it's just b-roll and just panning round and stuff, because there's, there's just so much stuff going on, so... Anyway, I'm going to bed, I've had 17 baby shams too much, so... Good evening. Good morning. So, Sunday morning, and luckily there was no dickheads playing with air horns till 1 o'clock in the morning, and then starting at six, it was just the usual people firing up engines from, I think it was uh, quarter to six this morning. I don't know why, because they fire them up, run them for half an hour and then turn them off. And if anyone knows anything about batteries, it takes so long before it starts accepting a proper charge that it's like, why, why? Anyway, that's me being a miserable shit because uh, it's my weekend sleep in here, my weekend sleep. So, gonna get up, have a wash, get changed, cook some snap, and uh, have a little walk around, look for a present for little and and uh, yeah, I think we're gonna go over to the arena today and uh, see a little bit more than just walking around stalls. Oh, watching a bit of whistling diesel. <sighs> The international get up horns have started, so I suppose I best make some breakfast.
have we got, Chef? If you don't like it, you've got to pretend that you do, because it's YouTube. <laughs> That's it now, fairground DJ is going, so we're going to have at least 46 let's goes per hour for the next few hours, which is nice. Mm. More coffee required, definitely. Right, so it's that point in the day where um, we're packing everything up. Well, I am anyway. I'll drop the roof down and stuff. It closes to the public in about half an hour. <laughs> I can see you. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, it's been a good one. A bit of a strange one. And it's a hard one to film because it's like, it's a lot of the same. So I don't want to just do panning shots of every single truck and bore you to death. But if you're into this kind of thing, it's one of those ones where you're going to come and walk around because I mean, we've worked out what we've done, about 20 kilometers a day each day. Yeah, roughly. Roughly 20Ks a day just wandering around. And it's, and even up to this morning, we're walking down different bits and seeing a different setup and, and different aisles that you thought you'd been down, but you haven't. So it's been nice to see a lot of people off of TikTok and whatnot. And uh, yeah, it's, uh, it's one defo bring some food for yourself because uh, it is expensive and the portions are very small. And uh, yeah, seven, with seven quid a pint last night. Yeah, seven quid a pint. So bring your own booze as well. Um, but other than Ten that, quid for a oh sorry, tenner for, Ten for a rum, tenner for a rum and coke. Um, so yeah, that's that's hellish money. So yeah, also if you don't like sleep, this is the show for you. Um, I think it depends massively where you get parked up to who you're around. So I think if we were on the other side, it'd have been it'd have been all right. But here's what it is. Uh, I suppose you go to a truck show, you've got to expect some truck horns, but you'd think common sense would kick in after a while, wouldn't you? Then, uh, yeah, that's about it now. So we're going to try and, uh, we'll get half hour, wait for the public bit to shut. I'm going to try and get out. It's got two chances. So basically, Rich has refused to recover this vehicle all day because they are the guys that was doing the air horns all weekend. But within a few hours, he's now changed his mind. He wants to recover him because he's like a big child. <laughs> Tell you what, they're, new anch they're better anchoring points than what's on mine. When you get going, mate, come check us up on a road, could you? Where do you want to go up there or? There, there. What, back you to Bradford? Yeah, don't be like me. No pressure, Rich, yes? So we'll see. Will he get him out? Rich might have explained before in previous videos this, this Merc Sprinter, call me for. Um, know where he's capable as his Land Rover, so don't get me wrong, it is capable. Ooh. We've got some wheel spin. I think you might get him if you can get it. Uh, 
I don't think he's got enough weight. Shift yourselves. Just need to be a bit more aggressive. How does that feel to uh, take away your trip recovery virginity? Is he scan your owners, mate? Yeah, just, yeah. They're a funny breed, aren't they? Your last thing you really pull. Problem what? I've muddied the tyres up, so the yeah. one was grip, so she's pure white. Yeah. So big shout out to LMB Transport for the uh, for the ticket for the weekend, the support vehicle. Thank you very much for the company. Uh, it was amazing and it was a big eye opener. I had a great laugh. Nice to see everybody. And uh, yeah, hit that subscribe ready for the next one.